just to make sure that everything's clean. So from here, what I think I'll do is I'm going to go ahead and put a couple palm trees in. So the first palm tree I think I'm going to do is right about here. And all a palm tree is, we're going to start with a stalk. And our stalk is just a long, thin dagger stroke. So I'm going to start right here at the bottom. And I'm going to go just like that. And from here, we're going to start with our main branches. And that's five smaller dagger strokes coming off of our main stalk. So I'm going to come here. One, two, three, four, five. Now, if you don't know your dagger stroke already, this uh, palm tree right here is going to take you 20 minutes or more to do. And then once you do knock it down, you'll notice I can do these dagger strokes, just pow, 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 pow. And that's the way they really should look. So we've got our five bran main branches coming off of our palm tree. Now, each one of these main branches are going to have the, the palm leaves. And these are just more dagger strokes built into our five main uh, strokes right here. So I'm going to always start the center, and I'm going to start working these things out. So I'm going to come here, start working these dagger strokes out. And you'll notice by the end that our five main branches were only actually just a reference for our dagger strokes. So I've got two of them knocked out already. I'm going to come back and hit the rest of these three. Working just a little bit higher than I'm accustomed to. Usually if you're working on an easel, I recommend you set the height to where you don't have to reach too high or reach too low because that's going to mean inaccurate strokes. It's going to mean that you're going to end up with a lot of arm fatigue by the time it's done. Because if you're like me and you've done this for 16 hours straight, if you're doing a lot of this, by the end of the day, you won't be able to move your hand.